Welcome to Spitbucket. Here again, Renaud de Giron from Hennessy. Now, we've had a look at uh, these two, and just for the, for the record, $70, $180. Now we're moving to the, uh, the serious stuff. Yeah. Tell us about your pointy end. Here um, we're getting to, um, to, to parody, so just a moment of pure pleasure. Now we're talking about you know, living the experience. It's something that you need to live yourself, you know. Um, this is a, a, this creation, it's a blend of you know, more than 100 eau de vies that has been aged between 30 up to 130 years, you know, for the whole eau de vie. So, you know, what was uh, Australia, what was France, uh, you know, that uh, amount of years ago? 130 years ago, what was Australia? 18, oh my goodness. Um, mm. A very specific selection for, for this, uh, this party. Here, we're searching for elegance and delicate flavor. Uh, meaning it's, um, it's easy to have an old cognac, you know? Mm -hmm. You buy one, you, you put it in a, in a barrel, you wait. To have a great old one, it's totally different. So we've been searching for elegance from the very beginning to try to take the best, really fresh, delicate, uh, subtle it, it, it's, I mean, no one's going to mistake that for anything other than cognac, but on the, on the other hand, it is just so, almost so light, it sort of almost dances. It's just so elegant, so... It's quite a feminine style, you know, mm -hmm. so, you know, sensual, so uh, delicate. There's one problem with, with parodies, when you start, you know, you cannot stop. $600 a bottle, so good luck, <laughs> good luck not stopping. <laughs> and the thing is, um, this cognac, you know, as you can see, it's so easy to, to taste and to discover. You don't have to do any efforts. You know, it's just pure enjoyment. You follow the lead and just enjoy the moment. Even if we had a spit bucket, it'd be dry, I can tell you that now. That's just absolutely beautiful. It's got almost a creamy texture. It's just... It's, like, it's silky. Mm. You've got this very nice and extremely long lasting. Even, you know, after tasting this product for long seconds, for minutes, you will still have this very nice flavor in your mouth. It does. It just it just lasts and lasts and lasts. And I'm sitting here. I'm still tasting the thing. Um, yeah. That's just uh, that's wonderful. Now I'm dead scared to touch that thing because I, I swear <laughs> from this angle it looks like it's it's so thin it's going to fall over, and I'm not going to go near it. Um, and particularly as it's a smidge more expensive than that fella, isn't it? But, uh, we'll get to that. The Richard Hennessy. So Richard Hennessy was the founder of Hennessy in 1765. So mm -hmm. uh, an Irish man who found that the cognac area was a nice area mm -hmm. and started his business there. Mm -hmm. And uh, apparently it's been quite successful because we're still there today. And as a tribute to this, this gentleman, we decided uh, about uh, 20 years ago to create you know, an amazing cognac using some of the oldest eau de vie of our stock. Here, you know, the youngest eau de vie of this brand will be 50 years old and we go up to almost 200 years for the whole story of this man. So we're using some of the treasure. Yeah. So, yeah. In, in the Hennessy stock, the oldest story we've got is from 1800. And it's still, I mean, everything we keep, this is, we don't have a museum. Mm. Everything will be used at one point because they can always bring something interesting mm. to a blend. And if we've been keeping something for so long, it's because it can bring something, because there is a, um, uh, in terms of taste, in terms of aroma, it can bring something. This, uh, this might sound odd, but when we tried that, I thought that just tasted absolutely beautiful. But when you try this, it almost makes that look clumsy. This is just so... But this thing, this cognac, I mean, it's Richard Hennessy. It's a person. You need to spend time to discover truly this product. You've got such complexity, so much element. I can tell you, each time you will have a sip, you will discover something new. You will see a different dimension. You've got so much depth in this product that there's almost no beginning, no end. It's just a full experience of and, great pleasure. And, and that concept of, of that alcohol, it's just non-existent. It just, yeah. I mean, you, you could almost be forgiven for thinking that's you know, hardly any alcohol at all. But, um, it's just pleasure. It's, it's just a moment of pure enjoyment and, uh, and an experience to live. Mm. And don't let anybody describe it for you, you know, just, you know, you know, live it, that, do it the way you want it. It is just the finesse in that, it's just, it's just glorious. It's almost like, it's almost like drinking smoke. It's just so... Mm. Here you've got a high complexity, but in the meantime, it's something that can be approachable. And, and, you know, after testing it again and again, 
you get to a point where you see that, but there's no limits to this kind of thing. There's so many things happening there that pff, you can do that for ages. If you've got a lazy three grand, that's where it should go. That, that is just, uh, but I'm still scared stiff of that to can. I'm just, on this angle, it just looks like it's going to topple over. And, um, yeah. Uh, so I'm, I'm glad you're uh, enjoying it. Oh, thank you, you so know? much. Thank Cheers. you, and thank you for coming on Spit Bucket. This is uh, this has been a, a terrific uh, experience. Um, we actually have something more for you. You have to tune in later. Cheers. Cheers.